Okay, so in this video, we are going to fix our uh, RC receiver and our PPM encoder to the drone, the frame itself. And with this PPM encoder, we should have received two wires. We have this guy right here, or girl. It has red, black, and white lines. And this is gonna attach the PPM encoder to the Navio itself. And we also should have this beautiful colored set of wires that is gonna attach the RC receiver to our PPM encoder. All right, and the first thing we might wanna do is just connect all these wires together. So let's start with this. Here, let's attach this three wired pinout. It can be a little difficult to get those in. You wanna apply a lot of force there. And make sure it's the right side up. If you flip it upside down, it won't fit. You want the white wire to be close to these six holes on the PPM encoder. All right. Let's first plug in these colored wires to our RC receiver. So we'll see here, the first color is white, black, and red. So that white is actually for channel one. So we're gonna plug that into the channel one slot of our RC receiver. And that those uh, red and black lines are actually gonna power the RC receiver from the battery. That has a dual purpose right there. Then the next color in our colored um, wire set is orange. So we will plug in orange into channel two of our RC receiver. And remember, and remember, the signal wires are closer to the sticker. So you want your signal wires to be closer to the sticker. And then the next is yellow, yellow. So we'll attach yellow to channel three. And we'll keep doing this until we've reached the top with channel six. And we won't wanna plug anything into the battery slot. Keep going until you've plugged into the purple wire. And now this other end here with the white pin header is gonna plug into the PPM encoder. So where are we going to put these? Well. I think right here would be a good spot for the RC receiver and the PPM encoder needs to be close enough to the receiver to be able to plug in. So I think right here would be a good spot for the PPM encoder right at the edge of this uh, red arm here. Now we need to take our super sticky scotch tape and yours won't have bite marks in it because hopefully your dog hasn't gotten at it. But we're going to cut just a couple little strips. Let's start with the PPM encoder. Let's flip it upside down and apply this red sticky tape to the bottom of the PPM encoder and really press down pretty hard. Obviously not enough to like break the thing, but press down pretty hard. Then once you're confident with that, go ahead and try and peel that uh, red layer off. Now we have this sticky side exposed and that will be what will stick to the drone. Let's go ahead and put that gently in place, see if we like it. All right. I think that's a good spot, so I'm gonna go ahead and press down pretty hard on it to make sure that it'll stick to the drone. And there we go, that thing's not going anywhere. So we'll do the same process for the receiver. So now we need to plug in our output of the RC receiver to the input of the PPM encoder. So we will do that now. And this can be a difficult wire to place in there, so be patient with it. Now we have to plug this output of the PPM encoder to the Navio. So let's slip this wire through this little hole here at the edge of this arm. And then we're going to plug into the first bit of pin headers on the Navio. But make sure that the white line is on top because on the pinout for the Navio, the white 
or the top is for the signal. And there we go.